Hello, my name is Claire. Today, I'll talk about what I dream. Well, when you're sleeping, right? When you're sleeping, you will think about different things. Well, we don't say that we're thinking, but we say we're dreaming. Well, we dream about different things, right? But sometimes we dream about some very bad things. Well, let's discover out some of the things that we can dream of, okay? Well, let's get started. First, maybe if you dream about a good thing, right? You're having a good sleep. This means maybe you dream about living in a fairy world, right? Or maybe you're living with some magic and around. Or maybe a friend, being a princess or a prince. Or just be a rich one in the world, the richest one in the world. Well, those are good dreams and it makes sense to have good sleep. We say we're having good sleep. But what if we dream about bad things such as some zombies are coming or maybe you are died, you're dying, you're dead, right? Well, we say those. Bad sleep. We shouldn't dream about them. They're really, really scary. People don't like to dream about those bad sleeps. Okay? Well, let's see. Okay, first are monsters. Monster? Did you ever think about monsters? Um, I did. I remember I did. But remember, one day I did dream about a really bad sleep. Maybe I'll talk about it later. But monsters are really scary animals, creatures that you have seen, that you have seen, listened to before, right? Seen on the devices or on the internet, right? Not seen in the old world. In our world now. But thinking about it, on the device, you watching a monster in a movie, maybe, right? One day, my family sits together. My dad turned on a really scary thing called Baby Snack. I just remember it's Baby Snack. Um, but it is not a snake. It's another thing. It is a python, right? Python. Well, the python is a really big Animal, even bigger than two full-round men. Hmm, that's really big. Well, they go when some people have been seen in a look. Those pads that will drag their people up by their tails and cool them. It looks really scared, scary. But I watched until the last minute. It was so scary that I can't even sleep that night. I just think that maybe there's a python coming out from my bed. Hmm. Go and choke me like that. I can't even see it. Or maybe you dream about you're doing sport. Like one day you're doing sports in your dream and you get a prize. In some movies, you say, oh, yeah, I win it, and then you wake it up. And you feel something. Oh, I'm so sad. It's just a dream. But if we are in a real life, we wouldn't shout out when we're sleeping. Eventually, maybe when your mom's saying something, you still close your eyes, you tell her, yes, mommy, I will come out. <laughs> yeah. Next, you dreamed about food? No, I didn't dream about it. I love to eat, but I don't dream about food. Maybe you dream about your favorite food that you have never eaten before? Yeah, that's a nice kind of dream. Even if people that have thinking about food and eating, they would love to think about that. Why? Why? What would? I love, why would I love to eat for too much? I'm not hungry, of course. I'm not hungry all the time. But my mouth 
but I'm not speaking. I need to chop something. I need to eat something. And my mouth needs to exercise. I don't know how, but yeah, it needs to exercise every time. That's the reason why I pick snacks and candies all round. Fruits round for me. Every time I'm bored, I will just chop and eat. I don't know, but that's a really weird thing to do. I don't know if you're like me, but yes, that is why I love to eat. Many people say, oh, why do you eat so much? My dad sometimes says, are you a pain because you always eat? Mm, I'm kind of like pretty mad about that. But I know it's just a joke for my dad. But that always jokes. Okay, next. Okay, next one. Did you ever think about you have a superpower in your dream? Maybe when you're dreaming, you have the power to be invisible? Or maybe go through the wall? Talking with somebody in the hell or the heaven? Maybe flying? Did you ever dream about those? Once, I've dreamed about those. Yeah, I remember that I have the ability to go through the wall. One day, I have an idea to joke with my friends. I go through walls. Every time she looks around, I just pull her tail, her hair tail like this, but actually pretty soft. Right? Then. I go through the wall. She wouldn't see me. I really love how to joke it, but I just have to say sorry. But you know, I'm just using small pulls, so she doesn't really hurt at all. Well, I can still be her best friend in the dream now. Next, robots. Maybe you dream about having many robots to play with, or maybe dreaming about your being a robot. Hmm. Next. Monkeys, monkeys, they're really, 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 really funny, right? In space, you're dreaming about you're going to the sun without any food, clothes, and water. That's really dangerous, but yes, that would just be a dream. You can dream whatever you dream for. Well, I'll say that I will tell you about some of my scariest dreams that I've ever taken in my life, right? Let's see. I'll just um, show it with you by painting. Well, if it really doesn't fit, just tell me about it. Well, one day, I and my mother go to the forest and we'll live in a really small house. Near the forest are thousands of trees. Waters all around. There's many, many animals around. But uh, we aren't scared. But well, one day I go to the forest. Yeah, mm, I'm going to find some wood to make the camping fire. Well, then I meet a really, really dangerous animal. That's the lion. Well, I don't remember how, but in that dream, when I see the lion, I run really fast because just kind of like the tiger has noticed me. It has noticed me and it runs to me. Well, I run really fast and I run to the house. Um, I want to warn everybody. Also, my mom and my aunt, my uncles, my dad, my brothers, to go away, to run fast away. When I run to my house, to the house in the forest, I see that now there are lovers all around that dream. All, all around my, all around that house, not that dream. Well, there, I'm really scared in that time. Just got like I jump really far away and I want my people to run out. They run out too, but when they run out, they have turned into some more clients. I don't know what's happening, but I run really fast, but they all covered me up. But well, at that time, I'm really, really, really happy that I have wake up. 
I still remember it at this time. I don't know, but um, I watched the video and they say maybe this is a warning for you in the future. I don't know if it's coming true or not, but yes, I'm really scared and I still remember it. I remember that I dreamed about it last year in month 11. And in November, yes, in November 2021. I don't remember it exactly, but I remember all about that story. You know what? When I'm dreaming, I just can't remember all the way through the part that I run to have in their slava and I ended up without remembering anymore because I was really scared that time. Then I told my mother, my mom told me all about the story and I remember that. And the first time without telling mom, right? Well, that's really scary. That really scared me after that dreams. One day, yes, one day, I dreamed about ghosts. Yeah, I come to my grandparents' house with my cousins. My cousins watch some video and says, don't click on this link or something like that. I don't remember what's that link. But when I look in, there are some ghosts chopping, chopping, flashing, flashing. I'm really scared of that. But we're forgetting about all of those. We go and we play until midnight. When it's maybe 1 to 2 o'clock in the morning, we going to, we're going to sleep with our moms, with my mom. Well, I don't dare to sleep because I think that I will dream about it. I will dream about that ghost because I now remember about that ghost. Well, my cousin is also scared and afraid. Well, we all put on all of our beds, toys, and all of our teddy bears around us and under our legs so that no ghosts or anything can pull us out. We also put on our blankets so that nobody can reach to us. Well, they didn't reach to me and my sister, but they reach into my dream. When I dream about it, I don't remember, but I remember it's three. But when I look in a dark on a dream, I remember it's 3 p.m. nearly in that clock, right? In that hour. Well, I met a really, really dangerous thing. Well, just remember the song. Mm, back in time, right? It's, I've watched a video about this real mean. You say there's a really, really special god. That had to make the world to souls. Um, I don't remember that, but she is the one to sell those candles. He goes through the bridge, right? I'm the one to sing nearly that time, watching him going. Mm, you know what? He falls down, not because of any kind of thing. Not because he's uncareful. Uh, he's really careful in that time by my own eyes in the dream. Well, in that time, in the video they're describing about that song, they say that in the time that the man saw those candles walk, it's the night when all of those gods will go and take our people to be their ghost, to be their body, to go inside the body so that they can stay in the hall or in heaven. I don't know. I don't remember exactly what it said. But then I see that they have put in some oil on that bridge. 
There, when he falls down, we I see that there are gods pulling him down. That's really scared to me. It's really scared to me. Then I see the one who sells those frogs. Yeah, he comes in there some. Everyone's going on there. Well, if you want to know what did I dream about, what is the meaning about that song, just go and search about its name and its meaning. Okay? It's really scared for me. It really scared me, even when I watched the video about its meaning. I don't even remember why can't I go to that time, but I'm really scared. What about you? Did you ever dream about some bad dream that really scares you? Please tell me. I would love to hear all those from you. Don't say that you are a boy, you brave, you want to put out your dream. I am putting it out. Well, you also put it out. We just friends don't mind. Well, yes. Those are one of those dangerous dreams that I think about. What about you? Please tell me about your bad dreams. I love to hear that from you. Please not be a scary one like mine. See you next time. Have a good day.